Investors also try to sell off their assets, sell off their uh, shares because Russia Russia shares uh, were falling down because ruble uh, was having a big downfall. The RTS, that is the Russian trading system, it, there was 30% downfall in RTS because uh, because of the downfall of the ruble. And the companies, uh, they were having huge debt, Russian, Russian companies. So they were forced to convert their uh, assets into US dollars because they were finding very difficult to pay their debts because there was declining uh, ruble. So and obviously there was a huge interest with their debts which was attached. And and the, com the companies uh, which which had to pay their debts was also having any, uh, a big problem because they couldn't go for expansion because uh, paying debts was not easy task for them. There were two main causes of this uh, downfall uh, of this uh, downfall of the ruble, Russian ruble, which was oil prices, and the second one was the international economic sanctions. As we all know, Russia comes in OPEC uh, capital, in which they are the biggest exporter of oil. And last last year, what happened? As we all know, that the crude oil prices were going down. Earlier, it was uh, hundred hundred dollar per barrel. Then it uh, gone down till fifty dollars per barrel. So because of that, because of the shortage of their exports, Russia faced a big major problem. Because of that, their ruble fall down. So this was one cause. The second cause was their international imposed sanctions on Russia. This was done by US. Why? Because Russia entered in Ukraine. Uh, Russia tried to uh, exceed from their territory and they tried to enter Ukraine. Because of that, US decided not to buy any of the products from Russia. So they imposed sanctions on them because of this. So these were the two major causes why Russia currency, ruble, was facing downfall. It's what it was major downfall. That. That's it. Thank you.
tell you or explain you about that what a mother does. I think you all know uh, what your mother did for you and is doing. Uh, she makes a family. She makes. She makes a family. She knows how to make a house a home. And what we what we uh, call a woman, just a weaker sex? No, not worth it. She has a better position in a society to be acclaimed for. And mainly the uh, in my view, uh, women are not meant physically strong, uh, but mentally. They are mentally strong and as compared to men, they are more strong because if you are mentally strong, then you are more strong than a physically strong person because she has, uh, a woman experiences many nuisance, many eve, uh, eve teasing and many things in her life, so uh, which a man cannot handle, a man, which a man cannot handle, a man is very short tempered. He gets angry on small shoes. He can, he cannot keep keep the things to himself. But a woman, she has a very uh, she has a she has uh, much bearing power. She can keep many things to herself, and she did that since her childhood. She has experienced many uh, many uses in her life, and she has kept those things to herself. It's not it's not necessary to that she has told these things to anyone. So keeping these things to herself is, in my opinion, uh, it's too strong. And a woman, a woman uh, is a very strong sex, not a weaker sex. So woman is not a weaker sex, in my opinion. And I also think that you also agree with the same. Thank you.
My good habit of mind is uh, I'm hard working and I'm honest. Uh, the bad habit of mind is that lack of confidence that I feel. Um, I'm good at my painting skills and my creativity. Uh, I'm, uh, the skill I want to improve in myself is uh, my communication skill. Um, my personality in a way that would fit in a corporate space. My topic is uh, uh, real learning uh, came, uh, takes place through experience. I agree with the statement that not, le not all learning came through, uh, takes place through the uh, classroom. All knowledge should not be obtained in the classroom. That uh, the main, uh, because teacher can only taught us the topics and the subjects. But some lessons which is pertaining to life is also uh, is came through the personal experiences. Every individual should be learning, not from the uh, every individual should be learning uh, more from the real life than from the classrooms. I believe that uh, real life is the best example for learning and obtaining knowledge. This is supported by the various reasons. First of all, personal experience. Uh, is uh, is essential for obtaining uh, uh, personal ex uh, personal experience is essential for obtaining an indelible knowledge. For instance, if a teacher uh, taught about the animals, and uh, but is is uh, do you think is it sufficient uh, for uh, uh, is it sufficient for the children? No, it is not. Because uh, if the teacher uh, take them to the zoo and explain about the info, uh, explain about the uh, those animals, though, uh, they will never forget that information. The uh, uh, information uh, which they got from the personal experience, they will never they, uh, that information will never be drained out. Secondly, the uh, relationship people uh, uh, among the people as well as the uh, uh, friendship values cannot be taught by a teacher in the classrooms. That can only be known uh, with the personal experiences. <laughs> Further, uh, if, a, if a young guy do not realize the uh, if a young guy do not realize the about the money value, the same person will know about the money value uh, till he starts earning. Uh, finally, is uh, sometimes a uh, new discovery and a new thing was discovered by a personal experience, not by the classroom knowledge. So, with these instances, I conclude that an illiterate person uh, can make a different business successfully with using his personal experiences, but uh, an erudite person uh, might fail in their business with just a lack of experience. Thank you, and have a nice day.
goals achievable which will make you think positively you should always feel good about yourself have a positive attitude towards yourself first say good things to yourself that you will be good ahead have a positive attitude within yourself have a control of your own thoughts because if you want to have positive people around you you need to be positive within first so that the people around you get positive vibes from you second thing would be that set goals which are achievable and try to have them like don't make too big goals just have some achievable goals to have a positive attitude mainly you don't have to uh, look so far just be near yourself and have a good attitude you don't have to look farther than the mirror and positive people don't really have the best of everything that they have they make the best of everything Around 1 a.m., they climbed down from helicopter. 